Uh, but we'll see. We'll see how how this plays out. We'll probably get a couple wins here. But Octavax into Kaf Grigus. Okay. Okay. Not too bad. Not too bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. See if I can throw in CMP there. I just love the fast move pressure. Victor Bell is probably good for this format as well. Okay. A, I guess we didn't get the CMP. Uh, they probably Dark Pulse or Psychic. Um, let's see what they have. I don't think they're going to go for the Shadow Ball. Yeah, the Dark Pulse makes sense there. Oh, you know what? Mm. Okay. I guess I should have went into Claude Sire. Uh, but that's okay. I, I immediately saw the Obstagoon and switched out. I guess this is okay, we'll see. So they, they went into the Obstagoon, so they probably have something else that's strong. Well, it's hard to say. Okay, I do get off another one, nice. So that's good for me. I don't want a shield, even though I think they can counter me down. Oh no, they can't unless they shield. Okay, so they I guess they will. Sh I think that was CMP actually. I guess they will shield if they have an an like a strong answer to Octabax. Uh, okay, so they don't shield. So maybe they don't. Who knows? Four. Five, six, seven, eight. All right, we're going to go ahead and take one weather ball. It's not going to KO. Uh, so we could definitely take one. Uh, but we can't take another. So we're going to go ahead and commit the shield here. I'm actually glad I did go into the Quagsire against uh, <laughs> the Obstagoon, right? I thought maybe it was double counter with like Metacham in the back, but it wasn't. Alright, so we can go ahead and go for the Stone Edge, which should be enough to knock out. Never mind. That's unfortunate. <laughs> I really thought that was going to KO. Um, but, okay, so that is actually really unfortunate for me. Yeah, so now this is going to be a G. G uh, it's going to be a loss now. Good game. Um, okay, so um, I guess if we were able to KO that, but no, you know what? I shouldn't have thrown the Avalanche against uh, the Obama Snow, but even if I didn't, um, I still think it would have played out the same way. I just would have saved a little bit of energy, but I don't think it would have mattered, though. Good game. All right, moving in. Octabax into Gligot. Okay, so we do see a Gligot lead here. This is not bad for us. Definitely want to stay in for now. One... Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Draw, throw the dragon claw. Um, they know it's gonna be a dragon claw. Oh, they do shield. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, eleven. There's no way it's a dig, but I'll shield. Right, nice. I do win CMP there, and I do get off this attack. So if they want to get off their attack, they will have to shield this. Um, and it looks like they want to. Now, if I shield, can I farm down? If they throw a dig, I think so. I'm going to go ahead and go for it. Um, hopefully they do throw dig. They do throw the dig, which is, is good for me. Oh, I should have. Okay, that was a mistake. I should have went into the other one. Uh, Quagsire. However, I did take a surf here, right? Um, um, so yeah, I mean, I just have to learn, uh, this team, to be honest, and how to play it well and stuff, but, um, we still get to the Earthquake, which is good. I, I don't think it KOs the Lantern, um, but it will get it low, and we live another Surf, so should be able to fun down after the Surf, at least. So we'll 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 take that. 
And we do farm down, which is nice. Two. All right, Stone Age is super effective. And this is going to be enough to KO the Charger Bug. Radford, what's going on? Can we get a shout out for Radford? Actually, I don't know if there's a mod in the chat. I'll give you a shout out after this. How you doing, my friend? And that is the GG's. Radford, if you're looking for another really good Pokemon, Octobax, I think, is really good for the Catch Cup. Um, I don't know if you have one. Um, I don't have a good IVs on this uh, for the Great League, but... Um, well, let me. I'm trying to give you a shout out here, Radford. Okay. Um, so I, right now I'm using um, Octobax, Quacksire, and Clodsire. So I know you were using Quacksire and Clodsire with Char uh, Charizard. I am using it uh, with uh, Octobax. Alright, let's see if we can get a win here. Octobax into Quacksire. Okay, um, Mud Bomb. I mean, they could have stolen, actually, they probably don't. Two, three, four, five. Okay, so this is definitely not Stone Edge. Uh, so they're going to throw the Mud Bomb. Do I throw Avalanche at this? Probably not. One, two, three, four. Throwing CMP there. Uh, I'll throw the Dragon Claw here. We do not shield. I, yeah, I mean, it makes sense not to shield. I just didn't want to kind of risk it, you know. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and shield and go for the Dragon Breath down. They need five more to get to another Mud Bomb. They might switch out. One, two, three, four. Wait. Do they need... Is this really... Unless this is an Aqua Tail. Unless if I totally got it wrong. It is. Okay. I was like, for a second, hold up. Unless if I got that wrong. Um, okay, so... A Trevenant's coming in. Obviously, Quacksire cannot see that. So, we can go ahead and go for the Avalanche here. Pick up the shield and then go into Clodsire. Because they switched out, So, which means I can switch out. Now, the good thing is I am a Poison type. Yes, I am ground, so I am weak. To I'm not weak to C-Bomb. I take neutral from it. So, I can go ahead and take... Well, they might Shadow Ball, actually. They do, yeah. That does more damage. Um, so that makes sense here, but let's go ahead and throw the Stone Edge. Oh, they do shield. I know it's a C-Bomb. C-Bomb would not KO and I would make it, but I'm going to go ahead and shield. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I wanted to make sure I got the Stone Edge off because my Quackside does not want to see that at all. Um... However, this does not KO, but it does do good damage. Okay, they tried catching and they were not able to, which is good. Okay, that's fine. Um, so they, they tried catching the Stone Edge, which makes sense. The good thing is I could bring in my Octopax here. They do find me down, but I don't think they add a C bomb. Okay, that's good that they're not, but let's see what comes in. Is it double grass? It's not. Ooh, that's good. Two, three. So it's not double grass, which is good for me, right? I can go ahead and throw the mud bomb. I don't think, yeah, two mud bombs don't KO. Okay. But do I get KO'd by two X's? Because if two X's KO me, they do win. Um, I don't think so, though. Uh, so I can go ahead and throw my Aqua Tail. Two Aqua Tails should KO. Let's see. Yeah, it does. Okay. But again, I should not... I believe I don't get KO'd here, so I can go ahead and throw my Aqua Tail. As long as I don't get KO'd, right? Do I do not get KO. Okay, I could have thrown the Mud Bomb as well. I, I was at it, but whatever. It's fine. We'll go ahead and throw the Aqua Tail, which will be enough to KO. And that is going to be a good game to my opponent there. Um, 
yeah, obviously Quackside does not want to see grass types. So it's good that the Trevenant came in when it did. Good game. All right, let's move on to the next one. Yeah, just learning these Pokemon. I've actually never used an Octobax before. Uh, I think I tried it once uh, for like one game. Like just like threw it on a team. Uh, be, not in Catch Cup, but like before, but I never really used it. But it's 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 a, it's a standard Dragon Breath use in Pokemon. Now that Alteria is kind of out of the meta for the most part, right? You see it here or there, but you really don't. Uh, Octobax kind of picking that up. Ooh, Uncolone, okay. All right, that's fine. Two, uh, okay, well. All right, well, we know this is Body Slam. I kind of don't want to take it to be honest, but I'm going to. Let's see, I just want to see how much it does. Okay, it does do a lot. Uh, Avalanche would KO, but it's more safer to throw the Dragon Claw. Uh, just in case they shield. They do not shield, but that's fine because I can uh, throw another one anyway. Um. So we can go ahead and throw the Dragon Claw. Do they shield this one? They do shield that one. All right, a little bit unfortunate for me. Um, I could farm down with Quad Sire though, and we did get a shield. Um, so we'll go ahead and farm down with Cloud Sire. Either way, this move is not going to do. Oh, Dig! Okay, never mind. I didn't even realize it had Dig. I wasn't running the Dig at mine. That's uh, good for them. Not for me. Uh, they do have an Octobax of their own, but I can go ahead and throw the Stone Edge here. Um, I mean, I wouldn't have shielded that even if I knew it was a dig, I don't think, but... This one I will shield and then switch out to preserve my energy on the Cloud Sire. Okay, this is a great matchup for me. Yeah, that's the GG's. That is a GG's, yeah. Quackside is really good just because of how many Claude Sires there are, right? <laughs> good game, good game. Cool. All right, let's go ahead and move into the next one. Yeah, and I've mentioned it before, but if anyone's wondering why I have unknowns instead of the Pokemon, it's because I wasn't sure what I was going to run, uh, so I didn't put uh, a direct team there. Um, but... All right, Octobax into Cofagrigus. Okay, so I, to be fair, I did lose to a Cofagrigus. Uh, earlier. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think that was CMP there. They're probably going to throw the Dark Pulse, but I'll probably shield. They do shield. Yeah, that was CMP. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and shield. Um, so they'll be at one, um, it, no matter what they throw, but yeah, it's going to be Dark Pulse. Makes sense. Two, three, four, five, six Thorn CMP. Actually, I don't think they threw. But um, we'll go ahead and throw the Dragon Claw here. Um, I'm actually going to go ahead and, and give up the shield. I mean, I guess I probably could have lived that, but... Two, three. All right, cool. I do. That's good. That I do get off this move. I'm not gonna switch out. Four. Guzzlord. 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 All right. Could you get Guzzlord this? I mean, I guess you could get Guzzlord this season since. My oh yeah, yeah. The shiny was released. The shiny. I mean, obviously you can if my opponent's using it. But that's right. The shiny was released, so. Godzilla was doing like the Halloween event and stuff. That's pretty cool. Uh, unfortunately, CMP tie, uh, but it's fine. Uh, Earthquake will KO the Guzzloid, and we'll see what's in the back. Uh, we'll see if I want to switch out or if I want to stay, stay in with my Claude Sire or not. Actually, it doesn't KO well. Which is even better for us because we do get fun, but what's in the back? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, I think we lose. Um, unless if I live in attack. No, I think we lose. 
Try and catch. We do not catch. But they throw anyway. Um, I mean, whatever grass attack it has. Does it have grass knot, energy ball, leaf blade? Actually, leaf blade wild doesn't KO, but they could farm us down, which is actually worse for us. <laughs> That's going to be a good game. All right, good game, good game. Um, no matter what grass type, I guess we would have lost, but very cool to see. Purified Blossom. Okay, cool. All right, we'll play to my opponent there. Um, yeah, it's, it's unfortunate that they had a grass type, but good game. Um, anyway, we'll 